Naruto, Eight Harsh Realities of the Uzumaki Clan The Uzumaki Clan used to be one of the most powerful in existence, but now they're on the verge of extinction. The Uzumaki clan was once one of the most prominent ninja clans in the world of Naruto. They are the distant relatives of the Senju, making them descendants of Azura Atsutsuki, the younger son of the Sage of Six Paths. The Uzumaki clan members are known to have great vitality, and on top of that are extremely skilled in Fuinjutsu. Which makes them special. Sadly, only a handful of members of this clan are alive right now and much of that has to do with the tragedy that befell its members. 8. The Uzumaki clan was envied by other villages. The Uzumaki clan once had their own village, known as Yuzushiogaku, and they were known to be one of the strongest clans in the entire world. The members of this clan possessed incredible vitality and great chakra reserves, which made them very powerful. This made the other nations envious of their power, and together. They started planning ways to thwart this powerful clan before it became too difficult to stand up to. 7. Everyone wanted the sealing jutsu that the Uzumaki clan held. Fuin jutsu, or sealing jutsu, are some of the most powerful techniques to exist in the Naruto world. Unlike other jutsu, these techniques could deal with things that one can't defeat, making them invaluable. In fact, even the first Hokage of Kanahagakure, Hashirama Senju, couldn't deal with some creatures and sought help from this clan. Most of their techniques remain unseen, but the skill they carried in this art was simply unmatched. Evidently, the Uzumaki clan's jutsu was way too powerful, and this only added to their troubles as many villages had their eyes on them. 6. The Uzumaki clan was destroyed by the neighboring nations. As the Uzumaki clan's power grew, so did their reputation. Slowly, they were becoming just as strong as any major shinobi village. And due to their few jutsu, possibly even stronger. This alerted the neighboring nations and made them band together to stop their growing power. Eventually, a massive war broke out and Yuzushiogakure, the home of the Uzumaki clan members, was completely destroyed. Most members of the clan died in this war and the country was never talked about in the story. This brutal massacre was certainly one that should never have happened as it wiped out a talented bunch from the world. 5. The survivors of the Uzumaki clan were made to scatter across the world. The attack of the neighboring nations on Yuzushiogakure led to its complete destruction, but not all of its members died. A handful managed to survive and escaped to other nations. While some were already in Kanahagakure, others, like Nagato's mother, scattered to the likes of Amagakure. Meanwhile, Karen was raised in Kyuzagakure and Naruto Uzumaki grew up in Kanahagakure. The attack on the Uzumaki clan wiped out their identity and most members went into hiding. Others didn't even know they belonged to the clan. And the only way to tell them apart was with their signature red hair. 4. The Uzumaki clan members lost their real strength. One of the biggest strengths of the Uzumaki clan members was certainly their vitality. Being the descendants of Azura Atsutsuki, they possess an incredible life force that can't be extinguished easily, their chakra reserves are massive, and they were feared for their immense skill in Fuinjutsu. With the destruction of Yuzushiogakure, their talent became a lost art for the most part. The remaining members of the Uzumaki clan have very little skill in Fuinjutsu compared to what the clan elders possessed. 3. The Uzumaki clan member's possible Kekiai Genkai remains a mystery to this day. While every clan with a Kekiai Genkai has all the information they need about its powers, the same cannot be said about the Uzumaki clan. The women of this clan seem to possess the ability to produce chakra chains from their bodies that are incredibly powerful. Karen was able to smash through wood release with their power. 
and Kushina Uzumaki was able to tie down the Nine Tails despite being in a near death state. With the destruction of Yuzushiogakure, all the secrets of this power were lost as well. The story gives little to no explanation on how this power awakens and what the secret behind it is. 2. The Uzumaki clan members were made into Jinchuriki of the Nine Tails. The Nine Tails has had four Jinchuriki in history, three of which belong to the Uzumaki clan. This is because the members of this clan are better suited to become the Jinchuriki of this tailed beast. Likely due to their incredible vitality. Hashirama Senju married Mito Uzumaki and eventually, she became the first Jinchuriki of the Nine Tails. Following Mito, Kushina Uzumaki was brought from Yuzushiogakure to become its Jinchuriki. And she was followed by her son, Naruto Uzumaki. Jinchuriki live a very difficult life yet the Uzumaki bloodline forced this duty on them. 1. The Uzumaki clan is close to extinction right now. After the destruction of Yuzushiogakure, the Uzumaki clan eventually became a part of Kanahagakure. Currently, the Uzumaki family, led by Naruto Uzumaki, lives there. Very few members of the Uzumaki clan are alive right now. Including those who are not in Kanahagakure, a total of four members are alive. The clan is thus very close to extinction. Before Naruto started a family of his own, he was the last Uzumaki of Kanoha, with Karen being another whose true identity remained hidden for the longest time. 